I realize this is somewhat tangential to pen stuff, but here's my dilemma. I've been helping out my girls with their stamping endeavors on their Christmas cards, and I was thoroughly disappointed with the ink that comes with most stamp pads. It's thick, blobby, and doesn't dry. I've thought about using some good old black ink to help the girls out. Has anyone tried this, or is there a reason that pen ink and stamping are stamping ink are different things? Um, I'm no expert. I'm definitely not an expert on stamping. I did a little research, found some threads on Fountain Pen Network and stuff like that of people that have been using stamping and whatnot. It does seem that stamp ink is kind of different than fountain pen ink. I've read some people that were able to use some of the fountain pen inks. If you were going to try it, I would say Noodler's X Feather would be the first one to try out, or maybe one of the like the Platinum Carbon Black or one of the carbon based ones, because those are going to be darker. You know, um, maybe a little, the, the X Feather especially is going to be a little bit thicker than some of the other fountain pen inks. Those would be your best bet for trying. But from from what I read, those that tried stamping with fountain pen inks. Um, the problems you run into is they're, they're going to be kind of weak in color. So I think stamp ink is, I don't know if it's made out of something differently altogether or if it's just much, much more, um, you know, saturated in color so that when you're stamping it, it actually shows through because it's not putting a whole lot of ink down on there. Not like a fountain pen that's just flowing ink out there. So I think it's the color, whatever color you use is going to be really weak and it's, it may not go on very evenly because I, I think you're going to run into the same kind of problem that you do when you're using a dip pen in that it's, if the ink is not like in a reservoir flowing down through and it's trying to stick to whatever surface that you're using, whether it's a dip nib or a stamping pad or something like that, you know, because fountain pen ink is so liquid and so viscous that it's not going to stick to the stamp pad, you know, stick to the, the stamp that you're using very well. So it's, it's not gonna leave like a really nice and consistent stamp, so. You might have to do some experimentation. If you've got some ink laying around, go ahead and cut up a sponge or whatever stamp pad. I know you can buy like blank stamp pads that are you know made to put your own ink in them. You can always give it a shot, but I think you would have to do a little bit of experimentation.